The Minnesota Commercial and its many vintage diesel locomotives have been the number one industrial short line in the state of Minnesota since 1987. In this series, we will discuss every engine on the railroad. Before we get to locomotives, we need to get to the basics. The Minnesota Transfer Railway was founded in 1883 by a one James J. Hill. The line stretched to central Minnesota, but the hub was always the Twin Cities. However, in the 1970s, the Minnesota Transfer began to struggle. Less than 10,000 carloads a year were coming in, and in 1987, Minnesota Commercial bought out the railroad. The now Minnesota Commercial Railway was looking to expand its fleet, and we are going to talk about it right now. Slugs may not be flashy, but they're an important asset to nearly every railroad company. They're a cheap way of getting extra tractive effort for yards or on the road. Minnesota Commercial, reporting mark MNNR, T1 was originally a General Electric built slug for the Baltimore and Ohio Railroad. Sometime between 1987 and 2002, T1 was repainted into Minnesota commercial colors, where it continued its work for several years. Unfortunately though, in 2014 it was rumored to be put out of service due to a bent frame. Minnesota Commercial No. T2 started its life as Southern 4023, a high hood General Electric B23-7. The engine changed hands until it eventually ended up on Norfolk Southern in 1994. Norfolk Southern used the engine until 2006 when it exchanged hands once again to the Minnesota Commercial. During or after the exchange, the Minnesota Commercial removed its prime mover, and converted it to a slug. From what I can tell, the engine is used occasionally. Information about this engine is rather sparse, but I will try my best. Conrail 1969 is a standard cab B23-7 built by General Electric, and it worked on the railroad for several years. It then ended up on Minnesota Commercial property in 2009. It may have been on Norfolk Southern, but I can neither confirm or deny. It got a similar treatment to T2, having its prime mover removed and renumbered to T3. It is the most frequently used slug on the railroad, still being used to this day. Atchison, Topeka, and Santa Fe number 123 is a slug built by the Electromotive Division of General Motors. It worked on Santa Fe until the Burlington Northern and Santa Fe merged in 1996 to create BNSF. When on BNSF, they renumbered it to 3964 and painted the letters BNSF to declare that it is owned by that railroad. It worked on BNSF until in 2013, Minnesota Commercial acquired the locomotive. When the locomotive came to the shop in St. Paul, they renumbered it T4 and recolored it in their Minnesota commercial colors. How it's doing right now is unknown. I hope you enjoyed this first episode of my new series. Next week, we'll be doing Alco and Montreal Locomotive Works Engines. Thanks for watching!